The Philadelphia Parking Authority is responding after a scathing audit was released today from the city's controller's office. Eyewitness News reporter Matt Petrillo was in Center City to explain what that audit found. Matt? Yuki, the audit found the Philadelphia Parking Authority has a bloated workforce and high executive pay compared to other public parking agencies across the country. Management salaries need to be reined in. Philadelphia controller Rebecca Reinhart took a deep dive into the Philadelphia Parking Authority, finding its on street parking unit is inflated compared to other cities with more than 600 workers. The inflation continues with the salaries of the authority's top leadership. The executive director of the PPA, for instance, is paid $210,000 a year. That tops the director's salaries of parking agencies in San Francisco, Boston, Houston, and other cities, according to the audit. While the parking enforcement officer, the PEO, the, the entry-level position, is paid the lowest um, of all of the comparable cities. So that's just not right. Is the executive director overpaid? Compared to other parking authorities across the country, it would seem yes. Drivers agree. Well, that explains what they're doing with all that money they're getting from these tickets. Definitely, definitely need changes. The Philadelphia Parking Authority responded to the audit and said comparing it to other parking agencies is comparing apples to oranges. It added, quote, no other parking authority or similar agency in the United States is responsible for the diverse transportation duties assigned to the PPA. But the city controller also points out it is crucial to have every dollar that's given to the PPA to have accountability for it because after the PPA covers its expenses, the excess money then goes to the city and the Philadelphia School District. Live in Center City, Matt Petrillo, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Okay, Matt, thank you.